Hello there everyone, this is Sofa King Caucasian. We're getting into the modding tutorial. In this video I'll show you how to install the Aether mod version 1.0 on Minecraft 1.73 on the Mac. Alright, let's get started. So you want to click the link in the description, it'll send you to this page. You want to scroll down to the download section. You need to get four things. Mod loader, audio mod, shaka, AHPI, and the Aether mod version 1.0 itself. This is a very popular mod. I will be going through the installation of it and you can see videos of it on Paper Bat VG's channel because it's a very popular mod and a lot of people have been asking for it and now it was just released in the time I'm making this tutorial. Alright, so you want to unzip all those four, the four things, Audio Mod, Mod Loader, Shock H, A, H, P, I, and the Aether Mod itself. So you want to go to your Finder, Library, Application Support, Minecraft. You want to go into your bin, you want to go to your Minecraft.jar, right click it, you go to compress minecraft.jar. You can delete your minecraft.jar. It'll have a minecraft.jar.zip. You want to unzip that. Now you want to delete the minecraft.jar.zip. And you should now have a folder called Minecraft. Now you want to rename that Minecraft folder minecraft.jar. It will ask you to add the extension. Click add. So now you want to open this up. And first thing you want to do whenever you're installing any mod is find the meta-m folder. Right here, meta-inf. Alright, you want to delete both Mojang files because this is for Mac and you only need to delete Mojang files, not the manifest, because it will work perfectly fine. First thing we're going to install is Mod Loader, so open up the Mod Loader folder, copy all the contents, which are .class files, and you want to paste that into your Minecraft.jar, it will ask you to replace, hit apply to all, and replace. Now you want to open up Audio Mod, and you want to copy IBXM and Yo.class, do not copy Paul's code. Now you want to paste that in your Minecraft.jar. Hit replace. Now in your Minecraft.jar, you want to find a folder called Paul's Code, which is right here. And now you want to go to Sound Codex, and you'll just want to stop that. And then in your Audio Mod, you want to go to Paul's Code, Sound Codex, and we're going to copy over to Codex IBXM.class into your Codex from your Minecraft.jar. So you want to back out, back into your regular Minecraft.jar. Now we're going to install Shaka AHPI. Now you want to go to Bin and Alright, so when you open it up, you just want to go into the bin. You want to copy everything. Just dot .class files. Most most in, uh, mod installation is copying files. Sorry for that noise. That was my cap. Uh, Alright, so you just copy and paste everything. Now we can uh, install the Aether mod. So you want to go into the jar folder. You want to copy everything. But here, just copy everything first, and I'll tell you what to click out. So you want to copy everything and then hold command and you want to click on the armor. That is it. So copy everything and paste it. Should have no overwrites. It will not ask you to replace. Now you want to find your armor folder in your minecraft.jar and go to the armor folder in your jar and you want to copy everything. All the .pngs and put it into the armor from your minecraft.jar. Now you want to back out of that back into where it's jar and resources and now you want to back out of your minecraft.jar back out of your bin and you want to be where your bin resources save stats and texture packs are now first thing you want to do is open up the resources folder and you want to copy the mod into your resources folder but if you already have the mod folder what you're going to do is you want to open up this mod and you want to copy all this and paste it in or open up the sound and then yeah I did not mean to do that but basically the mod should be installed correctly if you have any problems post in the comments I will try to get around to helping just remember to delete the meta-m folder and I'll start up minecraft to see if it alright now that you've started up minecraft and you see that it works we are uh, gonna go into the aether I'm pretty sure it's made just like uh, nether portal but with glowstone and a bucket of water but that is what I think, and it's not totally true. If you need any help, uh, I don't really know. No yeah, I did not make that tall enough. I don't really know that much about this mod, so just on the forms, there is a very detailed uh, instructions and tell us about all the items because there's a lot of stuff. I was just looking at it, and I I don't know what half the stuff is, to be honest. But I have seen uh, Paper Bat VG's uh, video, and I'm going to say this mod looks pretty sick. And if I had single player and I did mod, I would probably use this. Right. 
I am just failing. <laughs> I cannot make it. Isn't that how you make Yeah, there you go. Step in, it's just like the nether. Approach it. Moa's eggs can be incubated into uh, baby Moa's with the incubator. I have no clue what that means, <laughs> to be honest. Seems like some kind of animal because they're eggs and a baby something. Yeah, just my thoughts on what it is. So I've been getting a lot of wow. I really, I I walk out. <laughs> that is bull. I literally just walk out of the portal and I fall back into the real wor world and die. But I'm pretty sure I saw long. Am I really just in a spawn here? This is great. Thumbs up for a sh pretty bad comment. I mean, for a pretty bad spawn. Yeah, but um, so here's the mod, and it's installed correctly, and thanks a lot. And as always, if this video tutorial has helped you, please like, rate, comment, subscribe, and I don't know, it's just a habit to say like and rate and the same thing. As always, just rate the video when you feel it deserves, and have a nice day.